I walk with rice on me, so I can have what I need for a couple weeks if I do myself justice. And I'm starting to memorize all my poems so I can have them ready to give in case I lose my books or decide I want two free hands. I've spent some of the best nights of my life getting myself lost, but in the end I always think back to making a home. Fuck home. This isn't planned out youthful poetry. This is a need I could scream about like something's possessed me, but I can't find a way out. My life is the backstory of a fucker I don't even want to know. Fuck you, Brandon. I want you underwater. Then I want a new name in an alley where no one knows it. I want some filthy corner of the city the mayor doesn't know he's managing. A hole filled with rain and leaves and expired movie posters where I have secrecy. Where stacks of paper with my name on it means nothing. A place no one sees but who I want to. I want you there. I want your palm in my my eye. I want a mouth engulfing my ear and giving me something shocking. Something to keep me up in this hole excited instead of hateful and sad like this. Though what comes next stand is a fuck you to everything that came before. If we can't change the past, at least we can cancel it out. Let some gold we create blind me to the nausea and disgust I'm in right now. I want to be anonymous, taken for dead so I can be someone new. Born at 17, sure of what I want and guessing at how to get it. I want a city that I've never been to, making its case through unseen districts and an underground that feels like sleep or believable denial would this second. I want to give myself to people who've given themselves to drastic culture and change. I want to see them. I want to know them. I want to find one like me. I want explosions behind me. I want nothing to come back to. I want to pick favorite stars every night and never know if I'm choosing the same ones. I want my veins visible. I know what the fuck I want. I want what the fuck I need. I want a bed that isn't mine. It can be yours. It can be a couch. It can be a floor. What matters is that it comes soon. I want a map of America covered in dots myself and those I've chosen as the only way to connect them. I want Woody Guthrie jealous. I want what I hate my friends for having. I want to recognize people I used to know but never tell them and be grown enough they can't recognize me back. I want some gravel to lay my head upon. I want a cave. I want to be covered up in arms and catacombs. I want a bed that isn't mine. All my best poems feel like lies because they're what I'd be without compromise. And it makes me sick to see the difference between what I am now. But if this one comes true, so can the rest. I don't want food or shelter to count on. I don't want love or respect I haven't earned. Let this be up to me. I'm clever. Now here's your honesty. There's not a fucking sentence here I wouldn't cut off fingers to make true. And I'm trying to write something that turns these wants into something I had for a while. But I'm scared that this will never come. I'm scared of turning 18 without violent breakaway. I'm scared of my parents knowing where I am. I'm scared that I can't make things happen that go past words. I'm scared that I'm too scared. But give me a bed that isn't my own. And I'll work with what comes next. Ah!